In one of the worst kept secrets in the tech world, Samsung and Google jointly announced the Galaxy Nexus at a launch event in Hong Kong with the latest version of Android. But is it enough to wrestle with the best on the market? The Samsung Galaxy Nexus certainly has the specs to match the best smartphones on the market, coming in with a 1.2 GHz processor and 1 GB of RAM to keep everything swishing along at high speed. The screen is a big deal as well, literally. It's a 4.65 inch effort with an eye-popping 720p resolution. Think Apple's Retina display levels with a screen that's over an inch bigger. Other cool features include NFC, a barometer and 1080p video recording, but it's only got a 5 megapixel camera and that's not going to rival the iPhone 4S when it comes to snapping. A host of UK networks have confirmed they will be offering the Samsung Galaxy Nexus when it launches on our shores, but haven't given us a definitive release date as yet. However, Google said that we could expect the Galaxy Nexus in early November, so it shouldn't be too long to wait until we get a taste of the next generation of Android. We've got some early information regarding the Samsung Galaxy Nexus price, and it seems it's going to be costly. According to some independent manufacturers, the Galaxy Nexus will cost a whopping £46 per month on contract, but there is better news. SIM free, the phone looks like it's going to come in at a more palatable £500. You might want to wait before you pre-order though. The Nexus S had a swift price drop before it launched, so there's every chance the same thing could happen when the networks finally announce UK availability. TechRadar will bring you our full and in-depth Samsung Galaxy Nexus review in the near future, so stay tuned to see if it can position itself as a genuine contender for your smartphone affections.